I didn't expect it. It was a very pleasant surprise. I actually got an email from an alumni first, sort of just congratulating me. I didn't know what it was for. And then I kind of looked deeper into it and saw, wow, this is, I didn't really, you know, it's, it, it, it sort of hit me all at once and uh, really, really honored. I mean, I've, I've had a best four years of my life, you know, the past four years and just to top it off with, with a blank, with a purple blanket really, you know, puts the, puts the cherry on top and something I'll cherish forever. David was uh, exceptional from the from day one. Came in as a first year and sort of hit the ground running um, as a leader. He uh, he really wanted it from from the get go. So he and he got it. Second year he became captain and a strong player in juniors, very strong player. And he just kept getting better. And every year he sort of regimented the team, got them sort of to put their best foot forward on and off the court. Being a Western squash player, you, you basically compete in two different leagues, right? You have the U.S. and Canada. Um, and so obviously winning all UAs for us is very important, but at the same time, uh, we really want to make a strong campaign in the U.S. Um, so over the past four years, we started four years ago, 25th in the U.S. and we got as high as number nine. Um, so for us, it's, it's an all encompassing sort of season. We really love playing in Canada because we want to, you know, represent and continue the legacy at, uh, of West that Western has. But at the same time, we want to create our presence in the U.S. And I think that um, for the past four years, we've really been making noise in the U.S. and, and cracking into that top eight division. There's over 55 schools in the U.S. and uh, very competitive international recruiting. And Dave has led the way in uh, in those team trips and, and making sure that we're on on point and prepared for each match in the United States. But I'm, I'm very confident in a young captain who's uh, up and coming named Jackson K. And uh, I hope he's listening to this, but I have a lot of belief in, in him and his maturity and his leadership um, to take this team to where we should be.